So I'm just thought I would show you my swanky t-shirt. It's just so hot. So I'm just living in like funky t-shirts and I mean what else can you wear in Dubai, right? So getting bored of the jewelry, so I thought I would do <laughs> jewel t-shirts this week. I'm about to go to home bakery and meet some friends. So yummy, mm, cold and refreshing. <laughs> oh, so cold and refreshing and perfect. <laughs> so this is churros with pistachio ice cream, and apparently it's the best thing on the menu. Mmm, super creamy. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to a, well I've not done this before actually, so welcome back to my first, my favourite things that I've discovered that month. So I'm really excited to share them with you. I have beauty things, I have fashion things, and foodie things. So let's start off first with you're getting a sneaky peek and I know you're already loving it. So I have like my favourite silk shirts and I don't necessarily want to buy a new blouse that has the feathers on them. It literally comes as a slap band and then you just add it on. It's really lush and full with feathers. There's no like sparse feather quality here. And so we went to the Maldives recently so you know for my skin, for my legs, I was getting leg sheen. I, was, I use this, this is my favourite thing. I didn't buy it for leg sheen, I bought it for like cellulite, right? I was going to be out. So this is from Legology. They also have a cupping. Oh, I have that. Oh, it's upstairs. Can't be bothered to come upstairs, I'm sorry guys. But it's, it's a, oh. Okay, when I go up, I'll show it to you. Okay, let me go get it. Oh, oh this cup. So this is for cupping, which really helps with any toxins that you might have. And then you drag it up. I don't know if you can see that skin. It drags it up and then it takes all the toxins. So you do it all the way up your thighs. Then the other benefit, I mean, apart from the luxury, luxury smell, is look at the sheen you get on your leg. It makes your legs look lovely. I usually use the NUX, N-U-X-E, gold shimmery oil on my legs but i don't love the smell it just makes your legs look lovely and it gets rid of cellulite win 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 fashion and fun cellulite and sheen i mean it's like two in one so the other amazing item that i ordered which is again another beauty item i got this from amazon okay and this is for ingrown hairs that you might have basically when i saw that picture of kendall jenner in her bikini smooth 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 i ordered i did some research and i found out about this you're supposed to put it on your area for three times a day it works i put it on one times a day and it's smooth amazing okay my husband's home so <laughs> i am going to give this a wrap up and we're going to be going to time out tonight so i will also be showing you my fave place to go and eat it's it's definitely fave because there's so many places to go and eat there. It's a second time going and I just get really excited about where I'm going to go. And we're going with a group of people so we can order like lots of different things. So obviously Reef because I'm Reef crazy. Oh, he's locked out. Okay, I've got to go. I've got to go open the door. <laughs> We went to downtown to go to Time Out Market and basically it's in Souk Al Baha as you can see by those fancy fancy lights. I mean talk about fancy. It's also a peak of the Burj Khalifa. And that was me being cringe. Don't worry, there's more of that coming up. 
but for now this is the inside of the souk and these are shops that i've never ever been to and probably will never go to and i absolutely love this wall of covers of time out magazine so i thought i would be cringe again and take a cringy video standing next to the covers like an absolute weirdo whilst my friends basically waited for me just so we could go and place our orders but like i said i probably won't have any friends left in a few months and now i'm going to show you well my new best friend Thanks for that new little bestie. So let's have a look around the market. Let's look at every single food option. Knowing full well I'm going to order the exact same thing I ordered last time I came. I even went to look at a pickle. Am I really going to have pickle? Absolutely no. Eva went to go check out the bar. I'm not going to go to the bar, but if you fancy a cheeky little drink, check it out. There's also BB Social Dining. I mean, the food really does look quite phenomenal. It actually is foodie heaven. I even went to go and check out the Chinese food. I'm not going to order Chinese food. No, of course I'm not. But I have to check everything out before I make a commitment. There's even Ale Beirut. I live behind Ale Beirut. What am I doing? Why am I checking out? even went to reef okay to be fair i didn't have reef last time and there it is there's matter farm which one do i go for and yes basically your fancy ramen and your fancy sushi does come in a high school fancy canteen type of self-service situation but i guess that's all part of the fun right i know this is going to sound controversial i really didn't enjoy matter farm it was just far too red meaty for me and I, I just couldn't handle it. Although, to be fair, the mac and cheese did go down well. I'm also far too unrefined for this fancy coffee from Niger. down and I feel like I need an emotional glow up. I've not been working out, I haven't been to the gym for like three weeks, which I have to go tomorrow. It's the only thing that gets me out of a mental funk, so I'll have to go. So right now my husband's basically forced me, he's like, come on, get yourself together, we are gonna go out, we're gonna meet some friends. I feed off energy from being around people, so we're, we're meeting some of his ex-colleagues we're going to go to top golf in the heat so i'm gonna go and do top golf another thing i'm gonna suck at <laughs> it's taking it so seriously oh. What happened there? I'm worse because you, you guys did see me during the first shot, but I missed twice before I managed to hit it like here. I think it went. Oh, very much practice. Hey, Gwyneth! Now here's my top tip for top golf. Always remember to press your name so you get the points that you paid. What a rookie mistake, as demonstrated by this guy. Did they go in? <laughs> and then the lovely thing is you can order food and drinks to your pod whilst you're playing. So we sat outside, got to say, it was quite hot, too hot to eat actually. And then we moved inside for the football. So I just dropped my daughter to school. <laughs> and this is my glorious setup. What do you think? After the gym now, I'm gonna do a body pump class. Oh. 
and then this is me post gym every sweat bead. 